wizard. Sherlock Bones ordered me to find you. He's in urgent need of your assistance. Seek him out in Digmore Station at once. My young friend, I have been alerted to a crisis at the royal residence. Buckingham Palace is at risk. I fear the Queen may be in jeopardy if we do not intervene immediately. You can use my brother's credentials to get inside. Tell the yeoman warders at the gate that Mycroft Bones sent you. I'll meet you inside the Buckingham Palace courtyard. is closed for the evening, as the Queen is being entertained by an opera singer. It sounds like a lot of yowling to me, pardon my saying so. Now what singer needs such a large entourage? But who am I to judge? Bone set you? Which one? Mycroft! Of course, you can go right in, begging your pardon. get at the heart of the matter. Watson? Thank goodness you've come. We heard the chief whip shut the palace up tight, but not the reason why. Sherlock is most concerned. You've heard the Queen is hosting an opera singer? Curious. And the singer has a large entourage accompanying her? Curious. Although the Valencians originated opera, it was refined and enhanced at the ten houses. <laughs> Kill the Gun Engine! Kill the Gun Engine! I will review what I know of the Valencian art form while you get a first hand account. I'll keep an eye on Sherlock while you go into the statement and see what you can discover about this opera singer. I fear something's not right. Dangerous. Get out while you still can.
Battle Fang. You thrashed him thoroughly. I don't know what would have happened if you hadn't shown up. You're with Sherlock Bones, looking for the opera singer? I don't know if I would call her that. Burglar and Sneak Thief is more like it. Her name is Catherine Cheshire, and she's after the Queen's jewels. Her entourage has mesmerized the yeoman while she loots the palace. If you hurry, you'll catch her. I'll make my way out and tell Sherlock you're on the case. The woman said any rat who found the Queen's jewels will be rewarded handsomely. So keep searching! Eh, what's this? Boys, it's a mutton chapter. Bring out the knives. Sherlock Bones sent you. Someone should put him on a leash. After I'm done with you, I just might. Get the wizard, boys. But be careful around the face. What the woman wants, she gets.
This is not what the woman wanted. Stop me stealing the Queen's jewels and threatening her royal majesty? That's the most ridiculous slander I've ever heard. Who told you such a thing? Dr. Jackal? Why that... that shyster! That prevaricator! That imposter! I'm an artist, not a fighter. If I tell you what I know, will you tell Sherlock Bones to go easy on me? Good enough. Dr. Jackal hired me to gain him entrance to the palace, and to help him find the Queen's jewels. He's the one you want, not me. Dr. Jackal needs the Queen's jewels for some kind of alchemical process. He's using a mesmerizing automaton to hypnotize the yeoman. Jackal is probably in the main hall by now. You'll have to hurry back through the courtyard to catch him. <laughs> Dr. Jackal just filled me in on the sinister machinations of Katrin Cheshire. Did you arrest her? What's that? Dr. Jackal is the true mastermind behind this incident? Huh. I knew he was up to no good. And Miss Cheshire, you promised I'd go easy on her? We'll see about that. Blast in tarnation! Jackal played us like fools. He said he was off to find the chief whip to ask about the Queen. Head into the main hall, find the Chief Whip, and help him arrest Dr. Jekyll. We must ensure Her Majesty's person is safe. Lads, send up a message to the chief whip in the gallery. Who do you think you are? Dr. Jackal ordered me to keep this area clear of disturbances. Sherlock sent you. I never much care for that busy beagle. I'll give you a four to take back to him.
For me, wizard, I must run back to Dr. Jacker with my tail between my legs. Wizard, your spells have cleared my knackered head. Some foul golem hypnotized us with its noxious gas and forced us to obey. The Chief Whip is not a bad hound, but he received a double dose of the mesmerizing automaton's potent fumes. You'll have to defeat them both to break Dr. Jackal's hold on the mesmerized yeoman waters. Ship. I have been instructed to mesmerize you, wizard. Prepare to be mesmerized. Mesmerizing commencing in three, two, one.
rising commencing in three, two, two, three, one. Mesmerize. Commence one, two, three. Error, error. Invalid command. Shutting down. Ah, that was rough, wizard. But you've managed to free me of that blasted automaton's noxious control. Bully for you. Dr. Jackal nabbed the Queen and hustled Her Majesty into the rooftop lift before you got here. But he's jammed it behind him. Take this door back to the courtyard. You'll have to find another way to the rooftop where you can collar him. Go save the Queen! Don't tell me. You've defeated a mesmerizing automaton and freed the chief whip. <laughs> the reek of noxious mesmerizing fumes is a giveaway. Of course, the chief whip told you that Dr. Jackal is escaping with the queen. I concluded as much from the worry lines on your brow. Sherlock, doesn't that mean we need to act quickly? By the spiral, you're dead right, Watson. Now that you've broken the mesmerizing automaton's hold on the yeoman, there's only one way Dr. Jackal could get out. Wait, don't tell me. He must be taking the Queen to her royal airship. I knew it! Wizard, ascend to the rooftop and stop Dr. Jackal. And don't worry. The rooftop of Buckingham Palace is perfectly safe and easy to navigate. You'll be fine, but do worry. <laughs> Managed to catch my scent, I see. Well, I'm afraid Her Majesty is already installed in the Royal Airship and is waiting for me. Let's see if my trusted lieutenant, the dashing and dangerous Margarita Vizzini, can deliver my point. Greetings, wizard. My name is Margarita Vizzini. I am a master of the Opera Nova School of Valencia. It is my pleasure to teach you the art of this sword. And to be the last foe you'll ever face.
nothing but fail me, Valencian. Enjoy Newgate. Wizard, continue to follow me at your own peril. Inconceivable! I cannot believe you overcame my defenses. Truly well thought, wizard. Grab onto the ladder to ascend up to the royal airship. Best of luck catching Dr. Jackal. He's a two-faced fiend. Next time, I'll have to fight you with my right hand. <laughs> Mr. Pooh, did you order a penny extra cup? Such as what, Mr. Utterson? Say a young well from out, so I so smart dressed more or less like a wizard. What rot? I'd never order up such a thing. Whatever would I do with a wizard, Mr. Utterson? Perhaps when we got iron off in the sky, you wanted to see if a wizard could fly. What a clever idea, Mr. Utterson. What a clever idea indeed.
never did you have a head for fighting. Nor I, Mr. Utterson, nor I. At least we can take solace in knowing the control deck's locked up tight. So true, Mr. Cool. So very true. The system that controls the doors to the control deck has been tampered with. Each lever is connected to the gears in line with it. You can tell you need to use two levers to line up the gears properly. But you'll only get one chance. Who knows what will happen if you pull the wrong lever. There's a pleasing gear noise as you flip the correct lever and you hear the door to the control deck unbolt. Wizard, you vex me. It is one thing to mortify curiosity, another to conquer it. I have discovered the duality of self! In doing so, I tapped into an alternate, more powerful form. One unbound by rules and conscience. Call him Mr. Hound! But I cannot maintain Hound's form for long. I am trapped in this weak, pitiful body of jackal. However, with the Queen's jewels, I can perfect my alchemical solution and become Mr. Hound forevermore. You understand the call of power, do you not? Leave me to my research, or else we will become mortal enemies!
I see now I have done wrong. I must not force the Queen, or anyone else, to be a subject of my research. You have taught me that the doom and burden of our life is bound on our shoulders, and if we attempt to cast it off, it returns tenfold. You must suffer me to go my own dark way. Part of Barbara, wasn't it? You handled the situation cleverly, dear. Am I distraught? Of course not. One can't go to pieces at the news of every crisis from the spiral. We'd all be in a constant state of collapse. Now, bring us home, dear. Marleybone, a great service today, wizard. I'm sure my brother Mycroft is already informed. And I'll write up my case notes about it. 
How does the adventure of the Wizard League sound?